fearless adventurer is taken to the skies in a bid to become the first man to successfully cross the Atlantic Ocean using a cluster balloon system, just like in the movie Up. American Jonathan Trapp launched today from Maine, USA, as he began the two and a half thousand mile journey across the ocean. Cheered by hundreds of spectators, he was lifted into the air in a specially crafted boat by 370 giant balloons filled with helium. It's not the first time Jonathan has crossed the open seas. In May 2010, he became the first man to fly over the English Channel. This is one of the greatest days. And one year later, he then became the first person to fly over the Alps. But the Atlantic attempt, which has been years in the planning, will be his greatest challenge. The Atlantic Ocean has been crossed many times and many ways, but never quite like this. Floating at altitudes of between 18,000 and 25,000 feet, and at the mercy of the elements, the flight is fraught with danger. There's certainly the possibility of several catastrophic failures. It could take Jonathan up to six days to complete his journey and he'll be relying on a team of meteorologists to guide him. Always talk to that meteorologist as frequently as hourly. Jonathan's partner Nydia, who joined the crowds as they waved him off, is only too aware of the dangers that lie ahead. We understand that there's a possibility he might end up in the sea and that I might never see him again. We understand all that. However, we also understand how rewarding it's going to be when he does land in Europe. But despite the risks, she supports Jonathan's dream to cross the Atlantic. I believe Jonathan takes this risk with his life in crossing the Atlantic because it's a dream. So if anybody can do it, I know he can. Just weeks before the expedition, Jonathan spoke of his desire to see the challenge through. You know, I'm afraid of dying, but we still go forward with the expedition to satisfy ourselves, to satisfy myself. Flying into the unknown, only time will tell if Jonathan will complete the world record-breaking quest.